it's Mr. Clay here, and today um, I'm going to tell you how I started uh, Beyblade. Okay, so I was in school, and I was in fifth grade at the time, and there was this kid named Chauncey and Smaje. Now, I was friends with Smaje, um, but there was this new kid named Chauncey, you know? So, um, I didn't get into Beyblade until, you know, he, he told me. So, I was, um, he, I was like, Beyblade sucks, blah, 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 because I didn't, I didn't know. We were, it was in the age of metal. It was the, it was in the, uh, it was when the metal generation came out. And... And, um, you know, now, now I have Japanese Beyblades, but, you know, before, this was when I had Hasbro Beyblades, that's when I got my first Beyblades, um, but, yeah, like, so in order for me, in order for him to prove that Beyblade didn't suck, uh, we decided to go at the playground or park uh we decided we all decided we three decided to go to the park or playground or whatever to uh blade there and all battle it out there and um you know all the kids were there <laughs> But they weren't watching. Some of them were. This, not all of them. But, like, yeah, we all battled there. I was using El Drago, my friend. So, yeah, like, we he gave us Beyblades to start out with. I was using El Drago. Chauncey was using um, Pegasus. And uh, Smaje was using Dark Wolf. But his Dark Wolf broke. <laughs> like, his, his uh, tip broke in half. Um, okay, yeah, so, like, I, we battled a bunch, and, um, yeah, I had to get used to the launcher. I wasn't used to the launcher yet, but it was fun. Um, you know, and then one day, I got my own Beyblade Stadium. You know, I was really psyched by Beyblade, so I was like, and I changed my mind. It doesn't suck anymore. Um, and I decided to get my own stadium. This now this was Hasbro. I got I got some. Again, I have some tech here. Tell me, babes. But this was when uh, I didn't. This was when I first got into Beyblade. Okay, so I bought some suit. I bought some Hasbro Bays. It was the original Pegasus, Storm Pegasus, um, and then I got the, well, I mean, before that, um, my friend Chauncey, um, Chauncey, he, uh, gave me a couple of bays to, like, temporary bays just to train with. They were temporary, um, yeah, so he lent them to me, and... Um, it was like a custom, some custom bay. I forgot what it was. Wait, no, it was, it was Orso, some Orso. Yeah, it was Rock Orso. Um, and then he also gave me Lightning O'Drago, but he didn't give me the launcher. He didn't give me a launcher, like a left spin launcher, so I couldn't use him. Um, <laughs> and then one day I decided to get my own Beyblades. I got three Beyblades. Yeah, three. I got two Storm Pegasus. Like, I got I got the Super Vortex set, battle set, and I uploaded, I uh, opened that, trained with it, you know. And that, that was my first stadium. Um, by the way, it's, if you want to see the opening of it, it's down uh, in the uh, YouTube channel. Um, but yeah, 
I'll, I'll save up to buy another one. I mean, my Super Vortex Stadium, it's it's destroyed. I can I can put that in the description too how it got destroyed. Um, but yeah. Um, next thing that happened was yeah. So I trained in there for hours and hours and hours and hours. Um, and I met all tons of players from like places. Yeah, places here in Texas. I also met some in Washington. Uh, and, uh, yeah, Washington. I met a, a bunch here in, uh, Dallas and Richardson, Texas. Um, so, like, yeah, um, What was next? Oh, um, the next thing that happened was... Was, um... So... Yeah, I got temporary bays. And I decided to... Uh... Get, get some more somehow um like so I bought the reason why the uh, the whole uh thing of how I got so many bays is I bought some from Chauncey I bought a whole bunch from Chauncey um I also uh bought some I bought I also bought bays from the store too and online. Um but I'm gonna get the red side with bases soon, but like um Yeah, so I bought I bought a whole bunch from him for like five dollars a Beyblade. And you know, we used to do we used to he'd give me the Beyblades in the bathroom. Like like, we just sneak it in there. Sneak the Beyblades in the backpacks. Or we do it outside behind rock climbing wall. Or or we do it at lunch. Just, I pay him during lunch. Uh, and we, I, we, I did, we had to watch our backs. And that's, that's how... That's how I got a whole bunch of Beyblades. And then... What's next? Yeah, so... Later... I... There's this kid from the same school I... Uh... Originally went to. It was... Uh... Dartmouth. And... Like... Yeah, so... There was this kid named Ash. And he was a blader, but like, you know, he, he was plastic generation blader. So I, and and there was this other kid named uh, Kalechi. So we we were all in the same class, and we battled. And by the way, Ash, he's a kid. Um, that gave me this stadium and the other plastic generation stadium. So yeah, we all battled in this stadium with all my Beyblades, um, and it was a ton of fun. Like we during field day, there was there was field day, um, and there was also like uh, field day. Um, we also had breaks in between, so each time we'd have a break from like math or anything. Uh, or, you know, something, some subject, or we'd have, like, just parties and hanging out, we'd, we'd, uh, we'd battle 
We'd played and battle and train, blah blah blah. Yeah, it was intense. So, yeah. Um, I'll upload part two of how I started Beyblade. My early days of Beyblade.